The Cedarburg Bulldogs picked up where they left off on the ice last season, winning their first five games of the new campaign by a 24-9 margin, proving that despite a younger squad, they still have the talent to flourish. It definitely builds confidence, but especially having a young team, it uh, really helps bringing everyone together and believing that we can do great things. It really helps us out because you know later in the season when we get in those close tight games against some good teams, we'll be able to know that we can win each game and we have a good confidence level. Cedarburg is coming off its first North Shore Conference title a year ago, which included finally knocking off Homestead. This season, they're starting to figure out the new makeup of their group. Tough defense, speed, and a mix of youth and experience. We're actually a little bit of all of them. Before games, we're, we're real focused and serious and we get down to business, but you know, we can, we can have fun just like everyone else. We have great team speed and uh, we really work well together. We have good team chemistry and I mean, so far it's worked out well for us. Hopefully it continues that way. Even with the quick start, the Bulldogs are cautious and they realize the tough part of their schedule lies ahead. Homestead, obvious. I mean, last year was the first year we beat them, and they're a crosstown rival, so that. And uh, probably the big teams, Marquette, Arrowhead, this is the first year that we're playing them, so it'll be a big game, and the crowd will be into it, so I think so will the team. Peter Sylvester of Realty Executives Integrity presents our Team of the Week plaque.